Yirmiyahu, chapter 2. And the word of Yahweh was to me, saying, Go and cry in the ears of Yerushalem, saying, Thus saith Yahweh, I remember for thee the kindness of thy youth, the love of thy betrothal times, how thou wentest after me in the wilderness, in a land that was not sown. Yishrael was holiness to Yahweh, the first fruits of his increase. All that devour him shall be held culpable. Evil shall come upon them, saith Yahweh. Hear ye the word of Yahweh, O house of Yaakov, and all the families of the house of Yishrael. Thus saith Yahweh, What unrighteousness have your fathers found in me, that they are gone far from me, and have walked after vanity, and are become vain? Neither said they, Where is Yahweh that brought us up out of the land of Mithraim, that led us through the wilderness? through a land of deserts and of pits, through a land of drought and of the shadow of death, through a land that none passed through and where no man dwelt. And I brought you into a plentiful land to eat the fruit thereof and the goodness thereof. But when ye entered, Ye defiled my land, and made my heritage an abomination. The priests said not, Where is Yahweh? And they that handle the law knew me not. The rulers also transgressed against me, and the prophets prophesied by Baal, and walked after things that do not profit. For what reason I will yet contend with you, saith Yahweh, and with your children's children will I contend. For pass over to the isles of the Kittim, and see, and send to Qedar, and consider diligently, and see if there hath been such a thing. Hath a nation changed its gods, which yet are no gods? But my people have changed their glory for that which doth not profit. Be astonished, O ye skies, at this, and be horribly afraid. Be ye very desolate, saith Yahweh. For my people have committed two evils. They have forsaken me, the fountain of living waters, and hewed them out cisterns, broken cisterns, that can hold no water. Is Yishrael a servant? Is he a home-born slave? Why is he become a prey? The young lions have roared upon him and yelled, and they have made his land waste. His cities are burned up without inhabitant. The children also of Nop and of tahap have broken the crown of thy head. Hast thou not procured this to thyself, in that thou hast forsaken Yahweh thy God, when he led thee by the way? And now, what hast thou to do in the way to Mithraim, to drink the waters of the Shehor? Or what hast thou to do in the way to Ashur, to drink the waters of the river? Thy own wickedness shall correct thee, and thy backslidings shall reprove thee. Know therefore and see that it is an evil thing and a bitter, that thou hast forsaken Yahweh thy God, 
and that my fear is not in thee, saith the Lord, Yahweh of hosts. For of old time I have broken thy yoke, and burst thy bonds, and thou saidst, I will not serve. For upon every high hill, and under every green tree, thou didst bow thyself, playing the harlot. Yet I had planted thee a noble vine, holy a right seed. How then art thou turned into the degenerate branches of a foreign vine to me? For though thou wash thee with lye, and take thee much soap, yet thy iniquity is marked before me, saith the Lord Yahweh. How canst thou say, I am not defiled, I have not gone after the Baalim? See thy way in the valley, know what thou hast done. Thou art a swift dromedary traversing her ways, a wild donkey used to the wilderness that snuffeth up the wind in the desire of her soul. In her occasion, who can turn her away? All they that seek her will not weary themselves. In her month, they shall find her. Withhold thy foot from being unshod, and thy throat from thirst. But thou saidst, It is vain, no, for I have loved strangers, and after them will I go. As the thief is ashamed when he is found, so is the house of Yisrael ashamed. They, their kings, their princes, and their priests, and their prophets. Who say to a stock, Thou art my father. And to a stone, Thou hast brought me forth. For they have turned their back to me, and not their face. But in the time of their trouble, they will say, Arise and save us! But where are thy gods that thou hast made for thee? Let them arise, if they can save thee in the time of thy trouble. For according to the number of thy cities are thy gods, O Yehudah. For what reason will ye contend with me? Ye have all transgressed against me, saith Yahweh. In vain have I smitten your children. They received no correction. Your own sword hath devoured your prophets like a destroying lion. O generation, see ye the word of Yahweh. Have I been a wilderness to Yisrael? or a land of thick darkness? For what reason, say my people, we are broken loose, we will come no more to thee? Can a virgin forget her ornaments, or a bride her attire? Yet my people have forgotten me days without number. How thou makest good thy way to seek love, Therefore, even the wicked women hast thou taught thy ways. Also in thy skirts is found the blood of the souls of the innocent poor. Thou didst not find them breaking in, but it is because of all these things. Yet thou saidst, I am innocent. Surely his anger is turned away from me. Behold, I will enter into judgment with thee, because thou sayest, I have not sinned. Why goest thou about so much to change thy way? 
Thou shalt be ashamed of Mithraim also, as thou wast ashamed of Ashur. From thence also shalt thou go forth with thy hands upon thy head, for Yahweh hath rejected those in whom thou trustest, and thou shalt not prosper with them.